people. We are back. So, we have Omega Chaos here. Hi, Omega Chaos here again. So you're going to do your Dark Rebellion play again? Yeah, probably. Are you, just gonna, get up. are you just going to spam the shit of it like fucking Yuya? <laughs> <laughs> that man opened up perfectly. I'm like, of course. <laughs> But that was, that was a pretty decent duel. Uh, Ew, course. Necros, fuck that. Do you want to just get a different duel? Or do you want to actually Wait. duel it out? Well, I think uh, we can do something against it. Depends uh, how well the Necros player plays. What are you going to do? Oh, okay, first turn backwards, okay, I guess. As long as we don't get Shin locked, we will be able to do something, I guess. Okay. Valkyrie is so expensive! Yeah, I know that. How the fuck did Valkyries get more expensive than Bryonic? Come on, damn! It's because no, uh, because Bryonic is semi-limited, uh, and now free is pretty much necessary. Free Valkyries. Damn! I'm like, holy shit! I haven't been paying attention to the price, and I saw that. I'm like, damn! It's like a hundred dollar card now. I'm like, wow! Hmm. Like they're like, well, if Bryonic's not gonna make the deck expensive, this card will. It's not even the card. Let's see what can we do. Why would you go first turn Valkyrie and just leave it there and not even tribute or do anything with it? Yeah, exactly. Oh, that's weird. I thought you'd be gonna like tribute it and then tribute the monster that you searched to draw too. I don't know. I don't like Necro. Yeah, I'm... same here. I don't know. Should I go for Talk Rebellion? Can you? And run it over. Can you? Regular Dark Rebellion exists. I'm not the old Ice Rebellion. Uh -oh. I don't know. Oh. <laughs> Sure, why not? And I won't be able to destroy Valkyrie with that anyway. Why? Because it only destroys level 7 or lower monsters. Oh, 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 okay. Yeah, sure, why not? It's called thinking, sir. Yeah, exactly. I was like, he's like, Dark Land Fire Dragon, <laughs> what a noob! <laughs> <laughs> I say now would be as good as time as any. Necros don't really play much back row. Yeah, that's true. If any, really. I said I don't want to sound like a broken record, but you already know why I don't like Necros. Everybody. Yeah, I don't like Necros either. They are way too overpowered. That's not the reason why I don't like them. And especially, I don't like Trishula. <laughs> I dis I dislike Necros the same reason why I dislike uh, heroes. Your plays, because they search a lot. Yeah, your plays are so consistent that... I mean, you're so consistent that your plays are linear. I saw oh, that no, I must say. I saw that coming. Like, I guess that's that why you hate Raid Rappers and Prophecy as well. Yep. Yep. Which are two of one of my favorite decks, lol. <laughs> yep. Your plays, you're so consistent, your plays are linear. <laughs> I, I, like, I like the randomized factor of, you know, shuffling your, your hand... You know, shuffling your deck and drawing different hands. I like that factor. That's what makes Yu-Gi-Oh! Yu interesting. But when you're so fucking consistent that you can literally make your hand, it's just like, wow, alright. Like, I haven't seen this play done before. Hmm, give me your puppets. Okay. I personally like consistent decks because I have very bad luck. And I don't want to throw it. I hands. mean, I'm not. I'm saying there's nothing wrong with being consistent, but there's when you're too consistent, it just gets linear. Yeah. Yeah, that's true. It, I it, guess. It, it, like, the consistency where I draw the line where I like is Teller Knights, where you're cons when you start getting your consistent plays, you're fine. But at first, you know, you maybe you open up at the Rota, maybe you don't. Maybe you get the Dab, you don't. Maybe you run the Nuke. Maybe you run, you know, Sky Bridge. You know, vary it up a bit. Oh, uh, so Teller Knights are very li linear as well. Yeah, once the one thing, because it, cause it seems like they all have to go in a trigger. Like, it seems like it's, it's pretty trivial. much like uh, a ten event altar combination, and that's it. Oh, okay. I really thought he was gonna go into string, but okay. Uh. Wow, swords are ruining light. Like, who the fuck plays that? I hate that card so fucking much. <laughs> Why? Because it's annoying! Okay. Yeah, that's true. <laughs> like, it seems like, like every single time. And it seems like whenever they play swords, that after that sword ends, they end up drawing into another sword. And installing longer. Like, I hate that shit. 
Uh, I can go into like C101. Yeah, that's a good idea, I guess. But at the same time, the Necros Duel is called Trishula, you and then you're screwed. Yep. That's what I'm worried about right now. Like usual. Can you set your whole, your whole, whole hand? No, no, I, I have monsters. <laughs> uh. Well, it's up to you. We can, we can, we can take the little slow. We can push, guys. I can go for giant man, and we can just pretty much stall him out. But then the grinder will just, you know, detach, try to destroy, and then I'll, neg I'll have to negate, and then he'll continue on with the necro play. So it might just be best just to go into the C101. Yeah, probably. But if I go into the, if I go into, you know what? I'm gonna go into the C101, but I'm not gonna use 101. I'm gonna use uh, plain coat so I can still get my sense, because. If I get fucked up, I seriously doubt he's gonna kill the 101. I think he's the C101. I think he's just gonna handle it with fucking Trish anyway. Yep. So, I think. What do you think about the new red eye support? Mm hmm. It's uh, so good. It probably will be tier one even. Wow. I don't get. I don't give that. I'd say tier two. Well, it, it it depends what the future meta will be after Necros and all that. No, Necros is not, time Necros, the, the funny thing is, Necros not even the top deck in the, in the OCG. That's not even the top deck. It's a uh, Neptibus. <laughs> well, uh, Red Eyes is not out yet uh, in the Washer Share. What's not? Oh, it's about to come out, isn't it? Yeah, in, in April 25, yeah. I think. Yeah, end of April. So, pretty soon. I, I, I don't know. I, I, comparing it to Neptibus and, and Necros, I don't, I don't see it personally. <laughs> yeah. Their best card is that Red Eyes Fusion. Yeah, but uh, as some say that it's uh, a little bit uh, too dead when you, because I have to run someone's school for that lol. Shit, that's fine. I still think it's kind of a dumb card. I'm getting, I'm getting sick and tired of seeing Konami keep on making cards where you fuse from the deck. Like that, that's yeah, just... that's true, but at the same time, it's pretty pointless because you don't get any extra effects. Any, uh, or yeah, any, you just like to get to summon a fucking 32 beater or maybe that burns you for 24. And you have to run like someone's skull for that, so that's, Man, that's fine. Shit, <laughs> I run someone's skull for that. They could at least say, you know, if they could at least said if like if your opponent yeah. controls a monster and you don't or something. Like they don't have any restriction on that besides just the you can't summon for anything for this in a turn. Like I would have put like you know even the least Shadow fusion says you, if your opponent controls an extra deck monster. They could at least play it. If yeah, your opponent controls true. a monster and you don't, then you can go ahead and do it. That's fine. But, just, like, I think me and Slate lost the duel because they Red Eyes Fusion like four times. They fucking Red Eyes <laughs> well, Fusion when they already times. had the fucking Black Archfiend Dragon on the field from Red Eyes Fusion. Because they were double dicking. <laughs> okay, brown ink into that, and then you're just going to set. I'm kind okay. of lost. I mean, uh, it's not like I can attack you. You have sword, so I don't know why you're going on defensive. I, I have no idea thing. why the Necros Knights didn't use the uh, effects from the Graveyard. Like, seriously, I don't know why. Search for our 3 plus spell cards. Uh, is it, does it say cards or monster? No, it says if you control another monster. Yeah, you could have done that. If you control another monster, you can banish yep. this card and add and one Necros monster. Tap. Yeah, you could have done that. Hey. Not gonna tell you how to play Yu-Gi-Oh. We... Just because he's using Necros doesn't mean he's good. <laughs> that Swords is annoying. I told you! <laughs> You're like, oh no, Swords is fine, I don't even care. I just set Lance and end my turn. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Why'd you get another Swords too? <laughs> I seriously thought he was gonna trish me. Now it's gonna suck if this gimmick puppet guy can kill my, uh, can kill the C101. Cause then I won't, we won't get C101 back yeah. more. I get the plain coat. It's gonna suck. What do you think about Nordan not coming to TCG? I love it. Superstars. I love it. Yeah, same here. I love but it. But some are complaining because at the set doesn't have anything uh, very competitive. Not in, not every set has to be competitive. I don't understand why. Yeah, you I, I agree. Should. It has so much nice stuff in it. And it's nice if you if you if you yeah. if that's the decks that you like and that's what you're getting. It's a nice set. You know, I'm just happy that Konami actually cares. Like with with uh, Chaos Emperor not coming here, with banning the Dragon Rulers before we really get Dark Matter and no Noden, I, I actually feel like Konami actually cares about the well-being of the game, and it's not all about money. Well, there might be other reasons why Noden is not going to come out yet, at least. 
I can't do shit right now. I'm fucking swords. At least it ends on my turn. Ah, that's you know what? That's probably a dumb play. I was thinking about going into regular one on one, so if they killed it, it'd be in the graveyard for C one on one. But I don't think my opponents gonna be dumb enough to do that. They're gonna kill the C one on one, then they just kill it before taking out the regular one on one. It's like it's like when you have like uh like light pulsar and like red eyes darkness metal on the field, you just know which one to handle first. <laughs> So on. let's see what that necrospear can do. Show me, show me why this deck is the best. Because right now, you, you you just seem like you're a scrub. <laughs> yeah, it seems like it. You're like the pure so definition of a scrub. Person who's using you know a good deck but doesn't know how to use it correctly. Okay. Oh, dance princess. Well, here comes the unicorn rather. Oh. I guess Colossalus and... Yeah, uh... Colossalus and... And, uh... Wow. Wow, nice top deck. You top decked into one of them, too. Because I know you have the Valkyries, but you didn't have the, uh... Mm. That, so... Yep. So, Colossalus during the damage step. Probably. You're still going to get to revive it, but... Um, Dance Princess can... Actually, no. I think the Necros player did a mistake. I should have uh, used Colossalus uh, before I attacked with uh, Valkyrus, and instead uh, uh, running, over, running over it with Dance Princess first is would have been a better idea. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah, of course you don't get uh, revived because you don't have... Nope. ...the regular, regular run one in the graveyard, so... Nope. I guess it didn't matter anyway, then. My plan was fine, it's just... I didn't know he was going to do that play. I was preparing for, uh, for Trish, not... top yeah. making into, like... One of the... Like a perfect play, pretty much. Because we knew you had the Valk, so you either top decked into the Colossus or you top decked into the Claramere, and either or, you had it was exactly the enough for Star Eater. Hmm. That Colossus is going to kill me. Yep. Hmm. You got anything? Too bad, probably I'm not, not uh, affected fence. Is it the Colossus that's fucking you right now? Yeah, pretty much. I don't even know how to handle the Colossus either. Like, it, did it really have to drop you to zero and negate your effect? Like, don't you think that was a little extreme, Konami? I'm getting sick and tired. That's another thing that I hate. I'm getting sick and tired of all these fucking decks that punish extra decks. Extra deck is such a big mechanic in Yu-Gi-Oh, and you're just going to be able to just punish it so easily. I hate that shit. I think Assault Halberd is a, such a good card for any rank 4 deck, really. Because he searches himself, and he has pure, Exactly. And he's just so good. <laughs> yeah, I'm now running in Hardic Beasts, uh, Raid Raptors, uh, yeah, pretty much any rank 4 deck. I think Satan High School does run it. And it's a super rare in World Super Stress, so it's easy to get as well. But yeah, no point in going to Exodec, I guess. Not really, because then they'll just use Colossalus. So pretty much we have to summon a monster that deals with Valk or bait out fucking Colossalus. Which is still going to be a difficult job, a difficult feat to pull off. Overall, the Necros player got pretty lucky. His plays aren't even that good yet. He's just because he's using the bad, the best deck in his form, yeah. and he got lucky that we are stuck in a conundrum right now. <sighs> Maybe we can top deck into Tarkola, I guess. That would be the only option, really. I actually run two Tarkolas and Raigeki in this deck. Thinking about maybe I want to clear the field in this deck because uh, 
Oh, that's Rebellion Dragon. Can't see the Forbidden thing. Lance. It, it, it if the Forbidden Lance stays on the field, I might be able to bait him out. Oh, that's good. Because I can go, uh, I can go, uh, Unicorn, bring back Plain Coat. Then I can go into Battle Phase, go after the Valkyries, in which case he'll probably drop me to zero. Then Main Phase 2, I can make like a, you know, like a Castell or Exiton or something and just get rid of the Colossalus. So it's just like somebody once per turn. Is it once per turn? You can only use each uh, effect, okay. Oh. Yes, it's once per turn, of course. I, I, I literally, I just, I just, I just read, I just read during either player's turn you can target, and I was like, whoa, 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 wait, where's the once per turn? And then if it's, it's above, I'm like, okay. I guess he's gonna use the Valkyrus. Yeah, probably for a rank eight play. Yep. Uh, you can't, can't you can't do that because it's uh, right, you next can't like do monster. that. <laughs> so bad. <laughs> Are you shitting me? It's because he's in the top deck doesn't make you good. <laughs> it's not an F-Jack monster. <laughs> Are you shitting me? Alright, so I guess he's just gonna go ahead and go into uh, string and then maybe rank up. If he goes in... Oh, this card again. Again? I went Quick Chaos. Oh, yeah. Oh, okay. Now you probably will turn that card in. Give me puppets. Another rank up card, why not? As long as your number signs, I would run it if Plain Coat had a C. Does Plain Coat have a C? I don't think so. No. The only Heraldic like, Techies most that has a Chaos number is 69. I hope he'll probably destroy the Forbidden Lance, but that's fine. I still don't know his current situation. Yeah. Might as well chain the lamps. Well, what's the point? Like, uh, If you chain the lamps, just, then he like... drops down to, what, 1700 and he can't attack over it. Oh, yeah, exactly. Interesting play to say the least. I don't know. I don't like. I don't like C. Gimmick puppet giant hunter. I don't, I don't like him. I don't think he's that it's good. It's kind of meh. Quite yeah, fast. It's kind it's of meh. Weak, weak, weak attack and uh, it only destroys one card. Uh, Chaos number should be more powerful because they are uh, pretty hard to summon. Yep. Now you can't even attack over us. Lol, what's force of concealing light? What the fuck is that? The fuck. All that swords, pretty much. Oh wow! Okay, this man is just fucking hitting us with the swords. Yeah, the only problem we have currently is Klaus. If we can't get over it, then we can do something. The problem is that now I don't have the Forbidden Lance to bait it. That's the only problem. Oh yeah, that sucks. <sighs> do you have anything go over um, twenty three hundred in your exec? Uh, Dark Rebellion. Yeah, but yeah, still won't take him out. Yeah, can just so I pretty much zero. had to bait him out twice, which it's doable. I can do this, actually. Yeah, I can do this. Yes. Yep. Let me see. What's in my graveyard? Unicorn. That. 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 Uh. The topic triangle will be very good idea, actually. If yeah. You have a rank match in your hand. No, I don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that sucks. Man. I I can still get him. I can still get him. I still got this. It's just. Uh, yes, yes, yes. I got this. I got this. Watch this. You're gonna be like, you're gonna be like, yes, Daniel. Yes, you're awesome. I'm like, yes, I am. <laughs> I got this. I can handle the situation to the best possibility that can be done. To an extent. Uh, no, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna do this, and he's gonna negate me, which is fine. Then I can go ahead and activate Advanced Harger Art, summon two. Then I can go into like Lightning Chidori, and then Lightning Chidori can spin their set card and the Colossus, but then I still can't handle the giant gimmick Hunter. Fuck. Yeah, that kind of sucks. Yeah, that's the problem right now. I can get one, or I can get the other, but I can't get. I can't get both.
you know, nor can I summon something that's stronger than, uh, 23. And get both. That's the problem. Well, what? Wow, he didn't even want me to activate my effect to detach? Like, wow. Actually, you know what? Actually, I still might have to just activate my effect to detach for cost, because I actually want that, uh, monster in the graveyard so I can go into Lightning Chidori. Actually, you know what? You know, you know what? No, I'm not going to go into Lightning Chidori. No, I'm not. I got this. Yeah, I got this. I'm not, I don't need to go into Lightning Chidori. I mean, I mean, fuck the face down monster, but... Doesn't matter, I'm fixing the gated anyway, so they'll probably be like, lol, like you're fixing the gated, idiot. Like, I know. <laughs> I know that my effects negated. That's that's the whole point. I knew that. So it really doesn't matter who I summon, because I'm gonna actually be going into uh uh Dark Abandoned Exceeds Dragon. Yeah. Yes, yes. Dark Abandoned Exceeds Dragon. So actually I didn't need to detach, but it's fine. Whatever. I changed my mind at the last second, but Fine. But what about that chant hunter for? <sighs> yeah, yeah, that's definitely the problem. <sighs> you know what? <sighs> yeah, that's the problem. I forgot about the giant hunter being able to go ahead and pop my shit. No, wait, no, I still got it. I still got it. I still got it. I still got it. Okay, good. I still got it. Watch this. Watch this. I still got it. I still got it, don't worry. I still got it. Well, you also want the obvious piano from the hand. And of course you can summon that from the graveyard as well. Yep. Woo! <laughs> I did it! <laughs> I handled the situation. You, kill you. You, kill you. And you do absolutely nothing, because... Because you can't really do anything. I don't think Necros twice has any cards no, left either. No cards. And, and you can't, can't even, even act... search any ritual spells either because no. it has a monster on the field. Yep. Whew. Give me the give it to me. Give me my award. <laughs> oh, <that's laughs> fucking genius. <laughs> and I just do it, love. <laughs> you know, yeah, you just don't learn. Like, I don't learn. I got this. <laughs> Whew. All right, we're at uh we're at 22 minutes, and I have to have this video up in like 15 minutes, so what do you want to do? Let's not another, another duel. <laughs> okay, bear back. Alright, this video is going to be late anyway, so we might as well get another duel in. Yep. Because there is no way in hell I can edit, render, and upload this video in 15 minutes. <laughs> yeah, because I do want to show this deck off more. Even if my computer ran at the speed of light, the upload speed. Balls. <laughs> Ah, uh, I you, know, you guys know how much I hate that. I hate good luck, have fun. Cause you generally don't. <laughs> mm, interesting hand. So this man played absolutely nothing. So either he opened up like complete garbage, in which case I don't know why he's saying good luck, have fun, or he wants to drop a gores on your butt. So I guess you're just gonna get your knight and poke him and search. Oh, that's my Oh, I'm again knight. Okay. Yep. Like I had to tell that guy on freaking DM Doe commentary and that man was arguing with me. That was stupid. That guy was arguing with me about uh whether uh Armageddon Knight missed timing with Goblinburg. <laughs> no really. Like, like it does. <laughs> hmm. Hey, he was like Goblinburg summoned Armageddon Knight, Armageddon Knight effect like nope. <laughs> There's a difference between when and if in the game of Yugimon. I sent an inch to the grave. <laughs> Okay, I don't know what that is, but sure. It's a dark room monster. Why? <laughs> For one reason. You will probably see, it's probably see soon. Does that have anything to do with like Daku Storm or something? Like, I, I'm confused. <laughs> no, one other card. Oh, okay. That can revive it from the graveyard and make rank 4. Noden? No. I don't run no that. Ah, you don't run broken? <laughs> of course not. 
Yeah, you got them people who who still run Odin. They run they they. I don't get that. Like you're on the TCG list, yet you're using Noden. It's like it's like what the fuck? Like like if you're gonna run Noden, you should at least have your you know your uh, Instafusion limited. You shouldn't get triple Instafusion and triple Noden because then you're just exploiting you know both lists. Or just use one Noden. No. But no, nah, they're gonna run triple Noden, triple Instafusion, and just be like, yep, that's it. Yep. Can't wait for that to happen in TCG. Oh wait, it's not. No oh, red eyes. Okay, I guess. So, Everyone on the mother is playing that. Deck. Oh my god, everybody. Still working on it for uh, Red Eyes Bell. And said, so, their their eggs not that Im their Black Stone of Legends not that impressive. Their their the, a lot of their cards aren't even that impressive. Like the only good card that they really have is their freaking fusion. Yep. So, I, I just don't understand how you see this being a tier 1 deck when this is what it does. <laughs> Thank you. I right, draw right now. Alright, it's fine. And once again, this the same shit happened when I dueled with fucking Slate, where they summoned like a red eyes like this, and I would like to go into plain coat, but I can't because I need something to handle the red eyes. Yep. Same fucking shit happened in, the, in his video. Like, what the fuck? Like, I hate this shit. Like, why you why you gotta be all strong? Why you gotta be all twenty four, Dirk? <laughs> I personally would run the South Harvey Harvey instead of Coinberg. I think it's a lot better than this card. The problem is, is that if you have a monster on the field, I can't special summon. Yeah, that's true, I guess. Yeah, that's the problem. I was considering it when I saw you run it, and I was just like, yeah, that's the problem. It's the same thing why I'm when I'm thinking about bringing a Cyber Dragon to. Uh, to daily duels, then I probably shouldn't run uh, Solar Wind Jammer. Yeah, probably not. <sighs> you know, Cyber Dragon, of course, I have to run, but Solar Wind Jammer, like, yeah. <laughs> That's optional, and it doesn't seem like it's a very good option to choose. I also have Royal Decree. You think I should set it as well? Yeah, probably just in case. Alright. If they have MST or something. Take care of that red eyes. Like I said, if he never gets fusion in this duel, I really want to know how good his deck is going to be. Like, are you are you super reliant on fusion? Just like kind of like Shadal's, where if you don't summon from the extra deck, then their plays aren't that good unless they have like El Shadal fusion. Yep. Oh, right after. All right. I'm gonna, my favorite decks. I'm gonna go take a nap. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Smilos Nest, we don't activate the effect first, what? Are you serious? <laughs> like, why are you so bad? Wow. Hey, that was... <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> an idiot, apparently. Like, yeah, wow. wow! Wow! Two spells. Wow. Super neg. <laughs> it's a pretty good card in Raid Apples. He's just negging like, so hard. Like, <laughs> well, it's going to get the effect of uh, Miracle Anios at least. Okay. But I guess this deck can take a neg because it pluses a lot, so. Yep. Okay. Will I actually get to see some fucking Raid Raptor rank up in XC plays? Also, this deck is very reliant on back row, so as soon as we flip up this row to create this guy's <clears throat> kind of out of this duel. Unless he <laughs> starts going into some yeah, of, kind his, of. Raid, his Raid Raptor XC yeah, plays. It's uh, definitely more of a control deck. Yeah, it's a control deck. So. I want you to show me what this deck can do, because literally we're doing against two of the decks that I'm just not really impressed by. So, you're doing against fucking Dark Rebellion dot deck and fucking Heraldic, so you're clearly <laughs> the newer deck, so show us what you got. Okay, well, at least now he gets it. Yep. But already used the Mini Clanius' effect. 
so I don't think he can. They can use it. No, yeah, they, they can only use the effect of uh, mimicry once per turn. Yep, exactly. So not a very good place. So uh... far. Really. <laughs> See, and you wonder why I don't like this deck. Please, please, please so, so like I said, high high consistency, and it doesn't do anything. Please, at least rank up. Rank up, maybe. Please don't just leave this fucking two thousand booty monster in the field, <laughs> and then set a crap ton of back row, and then flip this row of the Kree, and you're gonna be out of this fucking duel, and it's gonna be stupid. Shit. You want it or no? Yes, I want it. Okay. Kind of want to set up my play. Okay, but what does it say? You can't special summon. Then the train. Oh. Uh, that kind of sucks. Yep. That was obviously just super convenient for him. So you got anything? You're just gonna take it slow. I have like okay. Should oh. I use it? Yeah, just throw it at him. Fuck it. Throw it at him. <laughs> I've never used that before. Oh wait, yeah, I have. <laughs> Fuck it. You just happened to be lucky that you attacked over there. Oh yeah, sexy. Goodbye. <laughs> Can use it on the graveyard. So. Yeah, yeah, to take no damage. You want to take the duel slow? And just get that out. You don't have to do much this turn. You're still chill. Hmm. I want to bait out that uh, readiness. Oh, okay. Because if I go into my water rebellion, then my opponent could just use it, and then I can't read. Yeah. Inflict any damage yeah. to what I came upon. You want to activate it now? Activate now, prevent the search. Nope, nothing. Uh -huh. I guess fine. not. I would have not been a bad time to go ahead and use the readiness. You proc the damage and prevent you from plussing. Okay. Alright, Mr. Red Eyes guy. Show me your plays. Because right now I either see using fusion. Or once again going in your blackstone and summoning another red eyes. Ooh, scary. <laughs> no. You got the red eyes fusion? Hmm. Oh, that blind mistake. What's the point of MST when Royal Decree is on the field? Unless you're gonna MST the Royal Decree. I don't know. I'm not gonna tell you I play Yu-Gi-Oh! It's just a weird play. I would've held on to the MST. Mm-hmm. Please don't misplay. Please don't misplay. <laughs> yeah, Please, don't I've it, seen so. a ton of people fucking misplay. Yeah, I know that. Like, they don't read that you can only use one of uh, Black Blackstone's effects per turn. I'm guessing that that's Black Metal Dragon. Yeah, probably. It's a really good searcher for the deck. Search for a fusion card as well. Do you still have plays? Yeah, probably. Think about just leaving it to you. Okay. Uh, if you still have plays, if you don't, then I'll I'll push. But if you don't, then then I'll allow you to handle it because there's really no point in me killing that if it's in black metal. I'll allow you to handle it so they don't at least get to search for a damn fusion. Yep. And what was the other guy? The Raid Raptors? He has, what, two cards in his hand? There would be more than that. <laughs> really? No, because he said a whole bunch of back row. Oh yeah, that's true, I guess. Yeah. So, I mean, he has a Mimicry. During your main phase, you can send this... This card was sent to the graveyard this turn, so he doesn't even get yep. the fucking Mimicry anymore. Yeah, exactly. Wow, that's so dumb. Alright. <laughs> Uh, I'm just gonna go into like plain coat. 
Yeah, that's probably a cool idea. Yeah, I'm just gonna plank out. You know, especially if he goes into like vanishing and then summons another vanishing. <laughs> it's fuzzy on here yet? No, it's not on Teo Pro, but it's on Yu Gi Oh Pro currently. I have been, have been testing that card on there. Fuzzy. Doesn't look very fuzzy. <laughs> it definitely helps the deck even more. You probably now only run uh, mostly raid after monsters. You don't really need uh, extra support. Maybe only a sort halberd, and that's it. Yeah, a lot of darkness okay. in raid adapters. Probably mostly you don't want to banish in that deck. Okay, I guess he's gonna foolish and summon and send mimicry again. Nope, he's gonna send harpist. Not harpist. Okay. I don't think harpist is necessary anymore. Not anymore. Not since he got mimicry. It's fast because it doesn't really soon as with the deck very well. No, it's too slow. And like why send that when you could have sent mimicry? So mimicry could have got you immediately. Plus, a harpist doesn't get it till the end phase. Yeah, we have to pay so the lure of vanish. So, so wait, 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 wait. You lure of vanish or vanish and, and then search your vanishing. Like, okay. You want to just take the duel slow? Just attack over his monster, attack him directly? Build up your resources for the play that they're probably going to push on in the future? Let's see. I mean, we definitely know that a, another Red Eyes is coming. Unless he was it's... dumb and he set that egg. This effect's not even once per turn, is it? Nope. Wow. So, do you run any other heroic ch challenges, or just him? Only... Only Assault Halberd. Oh, okay. You can also run Thousand Plays as well, as an extra target. I hate so, that Thousand Plays. Oh, he's so fucking annoying. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. So, let's see if I was... Actually, if I should have been cautious or not. Is it Black Metal? Show me Black Metal Dragon. Show me you're taking forever. <laughs> it does. Come on. Do something. Oh, it's Carbon Eddon. Oh, okay. I don't think it's necessary at all in Red Ice decks anymore. Like Absolutely not. <laughs> it's a dinosaur once. It doesn't have any soon action to the deck. Like, why? Why, what, why would you need that? <laughs> Why would you need to banish the summon of fucking red eyes from your fucking deck when you can already do that with the shit? It's a stone. Yeah, no. Nigga, you already took the damage! <laughs> <laughs> Too late. Oh my god. Uh, they're bad. You just gonna leave it like that? Unless you're gonna exceed and set up more. I'm going to summon this because I want to talk to him in the graveyard lord. <laughs> do you need him in the graveyard to pull off your plays or do you, you just need a dark? I need a dark to him in the graveyard. Basically. Oh, okay. Well, Red Eyes can't run over it. I didn't throw into any of my senders like Armageddon Knight and Prisma. Oh, okay. Okay. Because I kind of reduced the amount of my dark dragons because and most level 4 Dark Dragons kind of suck. Oh, yep, summon Blackstone, Tribute Blackstone, summon Red Eyes. Oh, so powerful, so scary. And it's going to peak on my Dark Rebellion and I then regret my play. Well, if he doesn't kill the Dark Rebellion, at least I'll have a big old strong beard. I'm going to gain half that attack. The only thing that sucks is I'm not going to get my plank cut effect. Nah, but at least I have a... Uh... Unicorn attached. Oh no, he's gonna go for the XC monster. Yep. Okay. I guess. Oh, we can use the effect and all. Oh, yep. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very rare case when oh. the it comes useful. Oh, the one time. Let's <laughs> target this and then the other one is destroyed. <laughs> Oh, they still have. I think we can use you it can again. Do it, you can do it again, but I don't think it's treated as red eyes now. Yeah, it's not treated as red eyes. Yeah, unfortunately, yeah. 
<laughs> At least he revived the right one. All right. Oh yeah, that card. Yep. So he can kill both our monsters now because he can go ahead and detach, activate the fact, detach, and summon regular red eyes. Regular red eyes take out the plain coat. Nope. Okay. Well, I can use it in the battle phase as well because it's a quick effect. Oh, okay. Yep. Once returned to Nita Post, turn into attacking the material and target one red eyes. Normal monster. Guys, watch some of it. Okay. You did that wrong. Yep. Now we are able to use the Dark Balance effect as well. Probably it's going to change the... The effect? Yep. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I think the effect still resolves. Yep. So we still cut. And you can flip it as well. <sighs> yep. <laughs> you know what? Actually, you know what? That helped. <laughs> that helped. Lols. Now my play is actually different. I'll take another 500. It's fine. I guess summoning out the Dark Rebellion was the right idea then. Yeah, definitely. Well, it was mostly because of they fucked up. Opponent's mistake. Yeah. <laughs> Didn't see that anyone even say anything. <laughs> Sitting there silent. Like, how many times are you guys going to fucking mess up? <laughs> so it's going on forever and you guys just keep fucking up. Please kill the Dark Rebellion. <laughs> But don't one on one or cast away, please. If anything. God, I wish I had my material still. You gonna go for your XC monster? He's gonna have three on the field, right? Possibly, a Rice Falcon is probably going to come out. Cool. More place Falcon. I don't care, I just wanna see it. Then he can like what? One of them. Motherfucker. <laughs> Four sticks, of course. I hate this deck so much. <laughs> Why? It doesn't do anything. I love this deck. This do deck something! So You're staring down. Thank you. Yeah, now I did something. Thank you. Fuck. Which could be a problem for us. It's fine. Kill our monsters. I don't care. Fine. I don't care. That's fine too. I'm starting to care less and less about your fucking shit. <laughs> Lulz. At least you did something. I'll give you that. Damn, I did not know Revolution Falcon had 3,000 booty. Yep, it does have. So, you got any way to get rid of that, or no? I do. Let me just cluster it or something. Yeah, if you can, I can, I can, I can easily kill it. So. Uh. Yep. 
duel does seem like it's going back and forth, though. Yep. <laughs> this is a good duel. I said, I'm just waiting for that red eyes guy to get his red eyes fusion on. Seems like without red eyes fusion, the deck's not that impressive. I seriously want to see you wrap it up with. Yeah, Hot same here. <laughs> I'm still waiting for me to have a chance to do that. You have the cards for it? Yep, I do. Okay. Probably, probably next turn. I have uh, Tragard and Astral Force in my hand, so I can't do it. I want to see that. They're going to be like... <gasps> <laughs> well. Alright, did you top deck Red Eyes Fusion? In which case, even if you did... No, no, what? Why? Why? <laughs> what was the point in that? <laughs> why are you going to ask you why? Like, Okay. And don't be stupid, just don't summon it. Yeah, I mean, it'd be dumb because you can't even activate his effect and you can't special summon this turn. Like, that yep. was dumb. That was... That was... That was, that, that, that was bad. <laughs> Alright, I'm not going to do much. Yep. Just going to leave it to you. Okay, shit hits the fan. I still got the resources to come back and end this duel. Yep. Definitely. Definitely. I got Advanced for Audrey. I still got Amber Conway. Uh, yeah, hopefully Kyrie they don't Kyrie quit Kyrie. at this moment. Though. That would suck. Yeah. And I got Rank Up Variance Force too, so. Yep, they quit. And they just quit. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> you jinxed it. Like, seriously. <laughs> ah. <laughs> You're like, I hope they don't quit. Quit. Fuck. <laughs> Yeah, it happens. <laughs> Alright, so go ahead and call it. So, thank you Omega Chaos for joining me. No problem, glad to join us always. Uh, if you guys haven't voted already, be sure to. It, it ends tomorrow. So. Yeah, last chance. Last chance to vote. Hopefully we win. <laughs> hopefully I ca oh. I, Hopefully I carried you to victory so you can get the best deck profiles. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> you know it gets nothing. <laughs> That'd be hilarious if you get nothing. Yeah, Alright, so thanks for watching, thanks for all support, and I will see you guys tomorrow. With uh, Stanzi and Stu using Ignite still. For the, probably the last time. Yeah. I should be ready to have Chaos Dragons up by next weekend. Alright people, thanks for watching.